Welcome to Hometown Happenings. I'm Carol McCarthy here with Don White, and we're at MnDOT, uh, Minnesota Department of Tran Transportation. And Don is a snowfall driver extraordinaire and trainer extraordinaire uh, for the simulator training here. And uh, I'm going to have him talk a little bit about uh, some of the training that snowplow drivers go through uh, prior to snowfall, hopefully. Yep. <laughs> We've had our snowfall already, but uh, the ma major snow. But Don, talk a little bit about this training and uh, what snowfall drivers uh, you know, are required to go through? Well, this is uh, with simulator what we're in right now that kind of uh, just gives them a refresher. They try to do it uh, usually during the beginning of the snow season, but the rotation through the state might get them in the middle of uh, January or February. But kind of give them a refresher on techniques, some defensive driving, okay. uh, a number of uh, different. Uh, scenarios we can put them in. So. All right, so how many drivers are actually trained? You're in District 4, right? How many yeah. drivers are go through the simulator training? I think we put uh, District Y would be about 65 oh. people through this in okay. a six week period. So. All right, so they have to go, I'm looking at the computer here and we'll, we'll do a little bit of a training ourselves here in a little bit, but uh, I'm looking at the computer, but do you have different types of scenarios that each driver goes through and do they have to go through every say scenario before they're yeah they have a it's usually a four hour block of training uh, once a year and it's a curriculum that's already pre-programmed into the into the system and it kind of builds on one they've had before and, and uh, some students might get more than one four hour block in a training period six week period just to catch them up on stuff they might have missed. So. Okay, so what are some of the scenarios they uh, go through? We do anything from def uh, defensive driving, plowing snow on a snow covered road as we got on our <laughs> one set up here right now. Um, different situations, uh, traffic pulling out in front of you, um, uh, dogs, cats. <laughs> what uh, we snow plow drivers have yep. gone through already. And pretty much what anybody right driving on a rural right. or city streets can run into at any time. Okay. So. so we're standing here in this training facility. Now is this here all year round or does this, uh, this is a mobile unit? Yep, this is in a 55 foot trailer and there's two two uh, driving pods like this and it travels all over all over Minnesota mm -hmm. um, in different districts. Like I said, for about six weeks it's in each district. So. Okay. All right, and uh, now how did you uh, become uh, a trainer extraordinaire here? It was one of those things I just raised my hand, <laughs> I think, the wrong time. But, no, I volunteered for it. I've been doing it now for almost six years. So, okay, all right. So every time it comes here, I'm one of the trainers. Okay, and you're from Perm? Yep, mm -hmm. yep. Okay. I plow snow out of Perm full time. So. All right. Now, have you, as a plow driver, have you ever gotten in a predicament, uh, some of the scenarios that you you play here on the screen? or? gotten close like <laughs> as I like say sometimes it, this makes you think about those before they come and mm -hmm. then you're kind of playing the old what if game most of the time when you're out in the road and okay. yeah it's it's helped quite, quite a bit sometimes so. <laughs> All right. okay well we're gonna take a break and when we come back we'll uh, test her out okay How about that I'm Carol McCarthy hometown happenings with Don White we'll be back with more after this Welcome back to Hometown Happenings. I'm Carol McCarthy with Don White at the Minnesota Department of Transportation. We're doing some simulator training today with a snow plow, and uh, I'm going to get in the simulator, and Don is going to direct me as best as he can. Let's <laughs> we'll see if we can get her hired. The wizard behind the machine here. <laughs> All right, so I just this is this is just a regular regular truck, right? Yep. The, the seat seat is adjustable. If you're close enough, you'll be good. Okay. You want to move back? Move back in the front, way. just oh, like okay. a regular. <laughs> Slide it all the way over this way and move back. Okay. Kind of hard. There, there you go. go. All right. Seat Gotta belt. Put my seat belt on. Be yeah. safe. Okay. Let's start this up. Yep. Turn it just like you would start a regular car. It's running. Okay. Excellent. Foot on the brake. Your brake pedal is the one on the. No, that's your clutch. <laughs> Gas pedal and then the okay. one next to it's your brake. All right. So they do press a little bit harder. Okay. That releases your parking brake. Okay. So what do I want to do here? Okay, you're gonna <laughs> go down. You're gonna, yep, just drive down the ramp there. All right. So Easier said than done. Put in part of drive. There, push I'll button. Push button. D for drive. Okay. There, yep, just touch it. 
touch screen. There you go. Okay. And head down the road. Okay. Good luck. <laughs> so this is just like driving a driving on a highway. Yep. I'm not plowing yet, though, am I? No, if you want to reach over to the right there and push the second lever forward. Okay. Your plow will go down. Oh, excellent. Ooh. Just hold it forward until it goes all the way. Should be, okay. Okay. And you can also push the third lever over and that will push your wing down, which is on your left here. You have a, you're in a left-hand truck. Oh, so there it is. I can see the wing. You'd normally be plowing the left lane of the highway. Okay. I'm moving at 10 miles an hour here. You'd like to take it slow in these plows? Or how fast do you usually go? Hmm. Kind of according to the road condition, and okay. you got to be able to throw the snow off the road. So. Oh, sure. Okay. I'm picking up speed, 30 miles an hour. That's semis. probably fast enough. Okay. Here comes your cars. <laughs> <laughs> Never been good at video games. <laughs> then we could change the, some of the weather if you want a nice, bright, sunny day. Ooh, okay. That uh, brightens it up for you. You got some mountains up ahead. Yep. Pretty nice scenery, let you see a little bit. So I want to stay between the. Yeah, you're plowing the, the left lane, so that's. You kind of look in your mirror, use your mirrors a little bit. Okay. You can kind of see the yellow line in your left oh, sure. mirror right there under your wing. Oh, so there we go, okay. We can darken it down, make it a nice sunset for you. <laughs> this brings back uh, memories of driver's ed with a plow. We can add a little bit of light snow to you. All right. So is this any particular road I'm plowing? Is it based on any kind of road in the, ooh, in the there state? There you got a deer and just ran into a deer. <laughs> <laughs> and you're correct. It's a good thing it's deer season. Perfect. I fixed you, so okay. don't hit that one. <laughs> nah, it's a, kind of a generic road. It's the, programs are based somewhere out of Denver, so it's, okay. that's where you get some of them on. But we do, there are some scenarios that take you in the town and in the cities and stuff with cars and that. You're not doing too bad since so you're all over the road. <laughs> I call it creative plowing. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, we can make it snow a little heavier okay. for you. Okay, all right. Whoa. And that okay. about does her in for visibility. Yep. Here we go, driving down the highway. Oh uh, well. Ooh. So how many minutes? Up. How many minutes do we, does each driver have to complete on this, or is it scenarios? Well, simulations they drive in different scenarios. They'll be about ten minutes. Okay. Ten, fifteen minutes, and then um, they got to drive usually side. four of those in a in a four-hour block, and then there's a computer-based training they do with that. Okay. Plus some PowerPoint and class instruction. Now I'm supposed to be in that lane, correct? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Somebody run into your wing. Yeah, oh, I, that's right. I better. There is still another truck behind me. Is that what the scenario is? Too? Yeah, you kind of left them in the dust <laughs> back there. And you're plowing at 45, so. Oh. All right, we've got some vehicles coming up here. Alright, I don't know what side or the road they're on. And I better slow down. Yeah, I won't do that today. Okay, well, Don, I know that Rain has given me the signal here. But uh, this has been a, quite an experience. I know that I would not want this responsibility <laughs> driving on this snow covered road. I appreciate more <laughs> what the snow plows do now. And I want to thank you for letting me uh, try it out. Try it out. Take her for a spin. We'll be looking for you somewhere around Christmas time when we can't get enough drivers. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks. All right, Carol McCarthy for Hometown Happenings on TV3. Got to keep my eyes on the road. <laughs>